Hello everybody and welcome. Today I'm going to be showing you a slash report plugin which allows your players to report other players in this awesome UI. Really helpful. Sound notifications to admin, everything. Really cool and good to have on the side. So let's get into this one. <laughs> Right, so basically there is one permission for this plugin, ReportSystem.admin, and this is for the admin feature, so you're going to want to grant this to people that you want to be able to see the reports. So a reminder to do that, select gperm, ReportSystem.admin, and then your staff group name. So it might be staff, it might be admin, it might be mod, trainee, helper, whoever you want to be able to see the reports, that is what you're going to want to do. So let me walk you through slash report. So players can execute slash report. They'll then choose a report name. So for example, awesomeness. Um, and then you can choose a player. So obviously me, I'm the only one online. What do they do? Uh, too awesome. Obviously you would put, you know, fly hacking, you know, fly hacking. What do they do? Reach, whatever. Uh, and then in here you could put notes, discord tag, you know, whatever you want to put in here for notes for the staff members. So then you either toggle this and submit and then it won't send and it will just delete this. Or you press submit here. And you can see because I've got report system to admin, it sends me a notification saying do slash report admin to see latest reports because there's been a new report. So this will do it if you log in and you've got that permission or when a new report happens. So slash report admin opens this menu where there's the recycle bin, all the reports you deleted, settings coming soon, exit, and then report list. So you go in here and it will show you the new one. So you can see all of the details, who reported it, the reported player, description, notes, etc. If they're online you can teleport to them, you'll be able to ban them, that's coming soon, or you can delete the report or you can go back. So if you delete the report, then that will now be in the recycling bin, which again you can do by slash report admin, recycle bin and it will be down at the bottom. So yeah, really helpful and really simple to set up. Literally all you need to do is check it on your server. Uh, well, don't check it on your server. I'd recommend you, you put it on your server properly. Uh, checking, checking plugins is not a good idea. So yeah, get it on your server with the .far and the pocket link and all of that is in the description. And then your players will be able to use slash report, set the permission for your admin groups, and it will all be set up like that. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. If you've got any suggestions for plugins that we should do in the future, then let me know in the comments below because I will happily do them. Uh, we've got some more to work on and then we'll be doing some bed wars etc. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this one guys. If you want to get your own cheap high quality Minecraft server then links in the description under important info and you can get one using code launch to get 25% off from mc.shockbyte.com with my affiliate link or like I said in the description if you want to join my server info is already also in the description uh, we're currently working on this new factions area so it's kind of a sneak peek you know enjoy what you get enjoy what you get anyway thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video goodbye